It's the beginning of February 2010, and I was about to ask how I made so much money last month, but I realize I stole $50 million from my subsidiary again. So we're not gonna bother raising any questions there because if we start raising questions there, we're gonna just have to explain to people where we got $50 million from all of a sudden, and I don't really wanna do that, so moving on. We do have a couple of deals coming in, which is potentially good news depending on what they are. Six million copies by December. Are we, we are doing a big deal by October, but I'm gonna take a chance and see if we can maybe do both of them. I'd be hopeful, I mean, we can technically do 1.4 million per month. We can't move 1.4 million per month because we'd need more couriers, but that's kind of okay. We'll figure it out. Uh, I do want to take a little bit of a look at the core team. They are still working on X, and this one wants some education. So let's do 2D, because that's a thing. Uh, you are core team and want some art as well. It's also going to be 2D right there. You are core team and want some programming. So let's do system, and then for art, it can be uh, 2D. Going down a little bit, we have two more people. We have you and the RTS team. So let's just max out your system, and let's for you go into 2D. Then we have another couple of people, apparently. We have you wanting to be an artist. So the Zippy team is also going to be 2D art. And then for programming, I mean, what do we need? We need networking. So let's get you some network skill right there. And that's hopefully going to help just bring Zip along a little bit, which is actually, thankfully, getting very close to being done. It's, uh, I think by i mean it releases in december of this year so i think wherever it is in june is where it's gonna stay because i don't want to spend i don't mind spending a while making it obviously i just don't really want to have it sort of run on indefinitely i think that would be a bad idea i'm also looking at tank base ultra 9 and i want to get this thing reviewed really quickly because it's looking like, it's going to be done really soon. And if it's going to be done really soon, I mean, it's currently a... Oh, it's a 6.2. Yeah. Okay. Suddenly, I am, I'm not thinking it's going to be done really soon. Uh, that's, that, is, that is a false. That is as false as what that is. Tank Base Ultra 9 can go back. Back to the drawing board a little bit, I think. Because it's... Uh, it ain't doing so good. Oh, boy. That's, that's rough. The reason I'm thinking that it's potentially in a good spot, though, is because, I mean, it's, it is nearly done, right? So if we can get it done, you know, in, into a reasonable state by, like, June, then we can probably release it in, in December. I just don't know if that's going to happen. Anyway, like I said, Zip is going to be... Whatever state it's in in June is is when it's going to move into beta. So that's going to be essentially right about now. There we go. So it's it's in this state is what it is. Let's get it reviewed by some let's let's outsource some reviews of all of our things here. We can afford to do this. It's pretty easy enough to do. So we'll do all that. We'll also outsource a review of uh, of X while we're at it. And let's take a little bit of a look and see what everybody thinks. So for Zip, it is a 9.8, which is fantastic. For Wave Studio, it is a 3.4. So we're gonna iterate Wave Studio is what we're gonna do. For Tank Base Ultra 9, it's an 8.5. That's good enough, I think. And then X is an 8.3 right now. We can probably get, no, we're not gonna iterate on X is what we're gonna do. We're not gonna bother with that. Uh, Tank Base Ultra 9 market release date is going to be December this year, is what it's going to be. And uh, we're going to start marketing Tank Base Ultra 9 is what we're going to do. So we'll do that. Uh, for Zip, we're going to start doing the same thing. We're going to start marketing uh, Zip. And I think we're going to... I don't... I, I want to get... <sighs> I don't know if I want to do this. Uh, promote Zip is what we're going to do. And also put out a press build of Zip as well. Uh, let's see here. Market and press build of Tank Base Ultra 9. 
Uh, let's let tank base go until the end of June. Because it's it's actually looking like we could probably max it out in July. So that's fine. It's not going to have quite the same beta period that uh, Zip is going to be getting. But we can maybe do a little bit more with it and maybe max out the code in uh, in July here. Also, it switches to July and it starts raining. It's like home. It's like being at home. I mean, I'm at home, you know, playing the game. But you get the idea. Anyway, I think... Uh, Tank base ultra nine ninety eight percent is as high as that's gonna go. So beta, and that'll be fine. We can also start printing some copies. Um, bring the priority down a little bit on that and do a maximum of five hundred thousand, I think. So there we go. And then for zip, we're gonna do the same thing. Maximum five hundred thousand, just like so. Bring the priority down a little bit on that. Uh, let me see here. Tank base ultra eight. Let's bring that priority. It's not being printed, is it? Um, let me see. We'll bring that down a little bit. And let's maybe hire a couple more couriers because I think we're going to need them. So what do we got? We got a, let's sort by type. We got couriers. We got eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. So let's just hire, hold on. Eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. I'm thinking we're going to hire five more. So one, two, three, four, five. And then you're going to be, let me see. So you're the 12, you're going to be 11, 10, nine, and you're going to be eight. So we're going to have three couriers coming in every hour for five hours, basically. And that should... That should help to move a lot, I would imagine. Having a look at distribution, we can now move 810 boxes. So that's definitely a bit better is uh, is what that is. Zip also has a decent number of followers, which is lovely. So here's hoping for good things. This is not going to meet its... Uh, this isn't going to meet its goal. This priority needs to come down a little bit. It, we we want to make sure we can do all of these deals is is what we need to do. I'll be a little bit annoyed if we don't. And by a little bit, I mean I'll be really annoyed if we if we miss out on some deals here and we miss out on... Oh, no. Uh, what, what team are you on? Core team? Ah, one thought... Uh, nice. Thousand dollars. 18 years. Thousand dollars. I'm a horrible human being. Um, I don't know what you specialized in, so I'm just going to assume... Actually, we can have a look, can we? We can go to teams and core i guess you could be an artist oh wow there's only one person with good 2d in the core team we might want to get another 2d designer for the core team actually so designer 2d begin looking core team compatibility uh let's go for you Seems like a pretty good shot. So there you go. Welcome to your new job. You've just replaced someone that retired and get paid absolutely nothing, which is great. Oh no, burglars again, really? I mean, they got arrested, but out of all the times you could take, uh, out of all the times, out of all the times, I need you to not, not do that. Cause I kind of need all that furniture quite urgently, actually. So there we go. Good news is, Couriers are doing good work. It's looking like this is going to get sorted. Octo oh, maybe not, actually. Hold on. 9153. I need to call some couriers is what I need to do. Let me manage staff. Uh, call 1, 2, 3 just to be safe. Let's just make sure this actually gets done in time. Although, oh, maybe not. Hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Insurance and savings account. What is this? Shirley Owens is retired as well. Another core team member. Interesting. Okay. Um, Let me do manage staff. Call one, two, three. And Shirley Owens, let's see. Where's the core team lacking at this point now? So that might have been a 3D design. Oh, that might have been, sorry, 2D. Let's get a high quality 2D programmer is what i want to try so programmer 2d begin looking we can go for you i think 
So that'll do. And let's uh, let's hope that I can get this deal done. Because again, I'm going to be really annoyed if we don't. 26,000. Hey, there we go. We got it done in time. Okay. Well, that was a lot of money on a lot of careers, but at least they don't hate me. So I've got that going for me. That's that's lovely. All right. So and then this. So there's not as much of that in storage as I'd like. That's a bit of a worry, isn't it? We might not get this one done. Definitely a chance. Definitely, definitely a chance we're not going to get this done. Um, I don't know if I want to take deals anymore. I feel like I don't ever get them done. I feel like I never get them done. I really do. Uh, market. I want a press release. And I want a press release. Is what I want. In terms of deals, we have print jobs. They're all relatively small, but they're all for December. So I'm all right. We've got some hosting deals, which I guess we could take. Uh, you want that for May? We could probably do that, but I'm, I'm just not going to. I'm not going to take any deals for a little bit because I keep messing them up. Zippy. Let's see. Programming. I don't even know. I don't, I don't even know what you need. Uh, Zippy is 2D. So I guess we could put some points into that. Sure. That's fine. Yeah, that'll, that'll be okay. We can, we can do that. Um, October, we've got November, we've got November, so we've got two things releasing in December. I am, I'm nervous about it, honestly. I really am. I'm really, really nervous. Let's see here. So this needs 70, oh, that's actually about to be done. Okay. So we can bring those up in terms of their, uh, their printing. Since they both release next month. And we're gonna be able, I think we're gonna be able to do this. A lot of bugs have been fixed in Zip right there. Over 600 bugs. Like, that's a lot. I don't know if that's... That, that probably doesn't say anything good about the quality of development that we have, but our bug fixing ability is fantastic. So, not going to complain there. Absolutely not going to complain. Anyway, it is now December. So, it's time to release these things. Let's go ahead and release Zip out to the world. We don't do marketing for Zip, and uh, let's release Tank Base Ultra. We also don't do anything for that. Uh, Paint has five active users. I want to cancel support. It will anger them. It's only f it's five people. They're probably fine. Uh, this has zero active users. Tank Base Ultra 8 does have active users, so we'll keep that supported. Uh, Zip and Paint XL. All right. I, I, I feel a little better now that we've got both of those out. I'm hoping to see some money, and I'm thinking what we're going to do is we're going to go to Zip, and we're going to say immediately, I want to port Zip over to any other operating system that I can possibly port it to, so these ones, essentially, so that it has got, you know, people that can buy it, uh, and then, yes, yeah, so Tank Base Ultra 9 needs to go to all of those operating systems is is what it needs to do so yeah port you with the rts team to those operating systems big job to do that but that's okay and then we're going to start a sequel is what we're going to do we're going to use an existing framework we can use core rts which has really great technology in it which is fantastic news we can speed boost this whole thing which is again fantastic news so this is less than a year to make tank base ultra 10 if it's exactly the same as nine we're gonna do tank base x and i want to throw more things so i want an advanced hud for one i want we want physics i think maybe maybe that doesn't matter for this game um recorded dialogue we can do that we can't really do this we don't have the artist for it 3d graphics has me so tempted though apparently facial animations maybe not so much that's that's gonna hurt things a little bit by the looks of it but we could start throwing some good things in here. I think, honestly, I think what we're going to try and do is adaptive music. We're going to try. We could bring that tech level up a little bit. Tech level 2008, but that's going to sort of wreck it a little bit. I think we're going to try and just make the next one. Right? The thing is, we can bring game design up to 2008 if we want to, but that brings it to two years. 
we're gonna we're gonna try and cash in a little bit is what we're gonna try and do and i'm very tempted to say that we're not even gonna touch 3d graphics we're not even gonna do it what we'll do is we'll do tank base x and have it be not quite a launch title for the x uh, operating system but we'll have it be the last one in like this timeline for the franchise and then we'll do the three we'll do the 3d like universe and that'll be the reboot and it'll just be tank base is what it'll be that's my plan so let's use uh what do we got here we got paint xl we can use that and then for the audio tool we've got wave studio which is fine and then the operating system it's gonna be x it's only gonna run on x it's gonna take about a year to do this and that's honestly okay uh in terms of the balance for marketing let's lean towards gameplay story we can do graphics we've got a pretty good balance there i think on to the next one rts team publisher marketing actually we have a marketing team maybe we don't want to do this especially since it is exclusive to our own platform so we'll just do we'll just do it ourselves we'll just try and market it ourselves and hope for the best so let's start developing uh tank base x is what we're gonna do um that's fine it's still in development that's okay zip what we want to do is we want to start working on a sequel to that immediately we want to use let me see here nerdsoft core av is slightly tempting um slightly tempting to use core 40 library though which i think we will do because it gives us a more modern uh setup here which i think is going to be really important so we're still less than a year with all of these features throw all of this in here it's about a year throw some data mining in there and it's you know a little bit more per active user not too worried about that this is going to just be uh zip x is what it's going to be because again this is going to be a bit of a cash grab so that we can sort of uh go ahead and throw this onto our own operating system so the 2d tool for this paint xl actually not compatible with selected tech levels i'm going to break my own rule and we're going to use picture point suite 2 which is only mediocre but we're going to use it because we can you know we we can although it's not uh, it doesn't exist it's not going to be supported in my system uh paint xl is what we're going to have to use the interface is old unfortunately but that's okay i guess uh interestingly i cannot put this on x x does not support this which is worrying in in a lot of ways um why doesn't x support huh i wonder if paint x oh i don't know i'm a little worried okay so zip x cannot go on the x operating system that's not good paint xl port uh with the i don't know what team to do this with let's do i guess the core team really quick i i yeah i'm not really sure where that can that can go we will port it to this though there are users there and I guess we're just going to wait for X to release, which is in nine months. Interestingly, let's get a really quick review of this from a uh, from outsourcing and see what the general thought is on it. Also, music, please. There we go. Right. So reviews of X. It is 8.4. Honestly, I think that's probably as good as it's going to get. I'm very I'm, I'm thinking I mean, it's 97 percent. It's not gonna be outstanding but i think end of january we move it into beta whatever state it's in is what it's in the like end of december 2010 we're sitting on 124 million 125 million dollars essentially what are we gonna go to that's my question hopefully money we did 129 not bad zip is a sequel to the highly regarded zippy x2 and is living up to expectations we released it bet fans are excited uh, it's definitely not the first release from nerdsoft but nobody knows them in the security market okay well no you don't need to be you don't need to be rude but all right that's fine um well worth the price not gonna move many copies whatever tank base so we've entered the gaming scene i feel like i didn't make a big enough deal of that 
overall it's great value not gonna move any copies up the marketing game that's fine so both of them are great and good which is fine and tank base ultra 9 5.3 million users that's or sorry 5.3 million dollars that's not bad and it's being ported as well both of them are being ported to uh to different systems so really not gonna complain there uh i do want to prioritize the port job for uh for both those teams though wow that design is going really quickly there that's not bad though um anyway it's end of january let's promote x into beta and uh let's hope that good things happen 129 million is gonna go to 136 million we got 6.3 million in profits last month that's not bad uh 2.8 million from this paint xl i think got ported and is making money again 5.3 million in tank base ultra 9 okay so tank base has a really good like fan base it seems that has me thinking that tank base x might actually get us in a spot where x itself becomes really popular which is kind of exciting to think about that's uh that's not bad though i feel like we're making we're making good money on you know by our own our own merit as it were 7.8 million last month even better let's have a look 3.7 from zip 6.1 from tank base 350,000 from paint xl both of these in the space of what three months two months have now made a profit and broken even which is brilliant news i'm actually really happy with that genuinely genuinely really happy with that that's 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 oh i feel like i've turned things around but i feel like i've said that before <laughs> i do feel like i've uh i've maybe maybe mentioned that before that's all right though that's uh that's all right we're we're doing fine. We're doing fine. We got 139,000 active users, 222,000 active users there. Uh, Wave Studio. I don't know when this is going to release. I really don't. In terms of my releases, I'm I'm thinking maybe Army Strike X could be something we do. Maybe we put together another the other gaming team and try and get Army Strike X for x as well it's not going to be released at the same time as tank base x it might be actually if we get a good team for it i think that's what we're going to do so i want to go into build mode and i'm basically just going to sort of copy and paste this room is is what i'm going to do so clone these put them there uh clone all of you and then put it let's see rotate and put it there and then I guess clone it again. And it can go there. And then these can all... Let's see. We don't want the windows. That's fine. We got these. We want to rotate. And we want to put it about there. So that should be decent. I think what we can do is just clone the styles for both rooms. That's the exterior. Oh, we don't want to do that. Interior, that color, floor... Let's go that color. That seems fine. So that's going to be... Yeah, this will just be... Yeah, I guess just the RTS room is what we can uh, what we consider this. So that and that, both of which need to be uh, a nice white color. Then we want the TV right in the middle, wherever it... Uh, there it is. We want some lights either side and then some paintings. And we'll just sort of throw some paintings kind of randomly around here a little bit just to brighten things up. And that seems all right. We don't actually have any books or any decorations in the rooms other than all that. So that's okay. Let's go to manage teams. And this is going to be the FPS team. There we go. So we'll add that. We'll say this space, this space, that space, and that space are all going to be switched to FPS team. And then this space here is limited to be a lounge, I want to say. So that should be all right. And essentially what we need to do is clone the the idea of the, uh, the RTS team. So develop software. Or sorry, no. Uh, we want to go to my releases. And Army Strike Lite is going to change a little bit. 
is what we're gonna do. So it's it's essentially so the way <laughs> the way we're wording this is a bit weird. We're doing a, it's a very Microsoft approach. We're going from seven to well, I mean they went to seven to eight and then eight to ten, but whatever with Windows. Tank Base X works for two reasons, and I love it because it's the tenth Tank Base. Well, it's technically tank base. It should technically be tank base ultra X, but whatever. Tank base X is the tenth game in the series, and it's also going on the X operating system, which is the tenth operating system in the series. It works so beautifully, and I'm so proud of that. Even though I didn't really do it, I didn't make the operating system originally, and I didn't make tank base originally. That's beside the point. Army Strike X doesn't quite work as well because. It's, it's not the 10th, but we're just going to do Army Strike X. And then when we reboot the series, it'll be something else. Um, that's a bit annoying. I can't use... Ah, I can't use a framework for it. Okay, let's use a new one. And it's going to be Core FPS. And uh, essentially, we can throw sort of all these details in there. That's approximately two years. I do want to do multiplayer. We, it's an FPS. I don't think it needs dialogue trees. I think it could use physics, but that's going to make it, that's going to make it a bit longer. Advanced HUD. Let's do an advanced HUD. Although gamers don't care about it, apparently. That's fine. 3D graphics. Do we want to do a 2D shooter? If this is going to take like th two years, it's going to be 2013. Let's do 3D graphics, I guess. 96. Yeah. Let's try and, let's, t you know what? Let's just reboot it right off the bat. Army Strike is what we're going to call it. Army Space Strike is what we're going to do. Army Strike colon Covert Ops is what it's going to be called. That Yeah, that's fine. Um, let's just put sort of everything in there. So we have Advanced HUD. We're going to have Facial Animations. I don't know what this limiting factor is here. We're going to do Cutscenes. And that's uh, fine. Boost your launch marketing with viral videos by introducing some bugs. I'm good. Approximately five years for Army Strike. I'm actually going to drop the Covert Ops and just keep Army Strike so it kind of resembles the old franchise. Uh, the server is going to be the store server. And I'm going to make this like 70 and then go next. So the 2D editor, we have, oh wow, we um, we have some choices to make here. So that's 1993 level 2D graphics. 3D editor is going to be GFX stop, I guess. Uh, and then the audio tool is... Wow, audio tools are way behind. Uh, approximately four years is actually not bad. And then we can release it for X, which isn't out yet. But we'll, we'll do it anyway. And that'll be fine. So marketing's fine. Approximately five years. That's a long time. But... We'll do the FPS team for both. We're going to publish it ourselves. We need a level. Oh, we need so much. Um, so it's recommending 10 designers, 14 programmers, 6 artists. That's a lot of things. That's a lot of things. We'll minimize that for a second because we uh, we need to figure it out. It's going to be it's going to be tedious is what it's going to be. But that's OK. That's uh, that's that's all right, I guess. Um, oh man, that's, that's so much. That's, that's, that's a lot. I think we made nearly 10 million last month. We did 8.9. Not bad. Not bad at all.